Here, champions ban 22% of the time, right? Odds are every day, you're gonna have to probably dodge one. So it's very likely that some days are gonna come where Belveth gets banned all day. Now we're playing Nocturne, a couple things started showing up for you. Since you're so used to this gap close, your movement's wonky. Since usually your champion has to go in, I think if I were you and try to get to plat, I think I'd just play Nocturne secondary. You want me to go Nocturne? Yeah, because I, I don't think you're going to have a problem with Belveth. Like right now, the way you're playing is fine. I think what's going to what's gonna hurt you more is just not having a solid backup pick. I would start red. Actually, would I start red? Hmm. Yeah, let's just, let's just do chickens here, actually. I like it since we're not getting a leash. And she's starting blue. I'm not going to get too on you about clearing right now because clears are very subject to change at the moment. Um, right. I know they're expanding the leash. Right. That's what I mean. Power. That's why I'm not going to worry about it. I would be very curious. If Graves is pushing into this guy, I think I would three camp gank it. So you would take E on three then? Move your camera up there. See? Um, yeah, I would because what's going to happen? He's going to put... You just saw him cue the wave. Did you see that? Yep. So basically, what that means is he's about to shove up, and then you're just going to path behind him with sweep. And that might have been his ward, actually, in river at the beginning. <laughs> we don't know, but it might have been. Sweep and go all the way around. Like, touch the other wall first. Yep. Oh, cue him. That's not a bad idea. Could work. Wait for Q, and... Oh! Wait, did she not get it? Damn. Shove, 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 shove. He's so low. Does he have Ignite or does he have uh, TP? Okay, shove, 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 shove. Cue the whole thing. Get in the bush quickly and then recall. Uh, she probably... She's not dead. Remember, Evelyn started uh, blue. So she she's going to bot side. Just get a long sword. Nah, I would undo that and get a long sword. Oh, let's go. ADCs. I would go all the way to my blue. I would check. Uh, yeah, she's going to be on it often. Or near it. Oh, okay. Yeah, she must have went right for it then. That means she did not full clear. That means she, she probably take like four camps, five camps, something like that. You're going to your romp next. You took a lot of XP from top. Just go up to, you don't want to just go up to Raptors since they're tier two camp? Yeah, we can, we can, we can, we can. Uh, it's fine. I just figure it makes more sense as far as getting the XP and then I can maybe be top again if Graves over pushes. Yeah, that's fine. I don't hate it. I don't mind the route. Uh, it's going to take a second. So yeah, I would just, yep. If we're doing this route, then we should go sweep. And then he has no flash. So if you get behind him, it should be free. Walk through. Don't even hit it. Yep. Okay. He's awake. All right. Let's go clear his ward then. I would go into lane after this. I would just shadow for a second to see if uh, Liver gets ganked when she's pushing. Because there's not much to do at the moment. And just shadow for a moment. Get your camera on it. She could be get ganked at any time. And it would totally make sense. I think you showed. You're a little too low on the lane. Yeah, recall's fine. I remember it's ravenous is what you're building and you could buy um, you could buy boots and another long sword is what i would do you wouldn't call fields no 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 boots and another long sword see i knew that the gank might eventually show up there it just feels bad sitting there all day i know i know but i, I backing backing was fine to be honest it was fine it's just uh we're there just in case Right. Right. 
Oh, they I would flank that, it. Sweep. But I have sweeper. I'll wait till blast cone. Oh. Yeah, walk it in. You have to W the Q. She has a uh, mana for it. Uh, pretty early. I don't know if this works. Oh, okay. She doesn't have mana for it. The fuck? Not Q. Damn. Where did Caitlyn go? She recalled. All right, let's just uh, clear bottom up. We need to get six. Poor Varus is getting shit on right now. Get ready to count and smite this and get ready to counter top. She's pushed. So she's like this thing that Evelyn's most likely to gank here. Camera on it, camera on it, camera on it. You gotta see. Sweep, sweep. Oh, she's mid. Can we can we counter? Can we counter in mid? Can we counter in mid? M mid? Oh god. You see this right here? This is a miss this is miss value right here. Because you're trying to force, but the problem is, go build towards Ravenous. Build the pickaxe first. Undo that, build the pickaxe. Better value. The problem is, you're trying to gank somebody who, at this point now, has a ton of tools to get out, right? His flash is back up. His E's back up. His R is going to be up, right? Diving him, you have to literally one-hit him. Whereas the gank in mid, there's a Cassiopeia and an Evelyn, right? It's, it's pretty hard for them to get away from you. That's Nocturne. Does that make sense? Yeah. So that decision is going to hurt our snowball. We're going to flank this and try to kill. I'd smite it. Go down and around. Sweep. Oh, we don't have sweep shit. Camera, 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 camera. You got to look. Okay, so Q has to be dodged, and you have to sidestep the traps. Like, you have to dodge the traps manually, and then W the Q. Nice. That was a good try. Nice try. You played it a little... You played a little too patient instead of walking at it, right? You kept trying to, like... Right. You kept trying to wiggle your way in. You just walk at her, right? And then... Try to side, like basically move out of the traps. Like you did, you kind of were doing the right thing. It's just you were playing a little too slow. Okay. I would just full clear bottom up. I would imagine this guy has no flash. I didn't see him flash, but it felt like a situation where he would have flashed what when you dove him top? early. Yes. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna go up there. Camera, she just ulted. She just ulted. Go chickens and then two. Mm, there you go. Yeah, that's good. It's good that you're looking. Uh, Shame when you get the assist. assist. Yeah, very unlucky that we haven't picked up a kill. Usually a Nocturne by now, you want something, right? She might be on Rift, actually. Yeah, so I, I would go... Zoe below her and her up there. So go, go, to, go, to, go to mid. Go to mid. She has no ult. She yep, has no yep, ult. Yep, yep. I'd flash on it. Yep. Good choice. Eat it. I would... Mm, damn. I'd... Oh. Holy shit. Shove. Shove. This is a little mind game, this. Okay. I'd go to, I'd go to Gollum. Her mid's going to be back. Go to Gollum. Use your pot. What about top? How's top looking? Okay. Fuck is this lane, by the way? Top Siver. Probably trying to counterpick the Greaves because he's a bully into melees. I don't know. Yeah. Because people think counterpicking is stronger than playing their main. So I would go up and around sweep. Evelyn could again be on Rift, so I would just peek it and then back. Okay. Good enough. You take a recall. I would check for bounties. Press B. Uh, so, what does he really stop her back here? Caulfield's is better now. The vamp. Oh, you have enough, yeah, you have enough uh, sustain in your passive. Another long sword, another long sword. Come on. There you go. All right, camera down bottom. She's going to dive bottom. Camera, 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 camera. 
Yep, there it comes. Oh, she's trolling. She wants to get shut down. Okay, now clear the gromp. We need to find a play where Caitlyn like overplays, gets hit by a Zoe sleep or something. And if that happens, then we can probably ult and smite. I would keep my smite unless I have two stacks of it. Okay. I'd back up. Yeah, I was oh. going to say. They're, they're way too confident. They're way too confident. You need to sweep that if you're going to hover that wall. Sweep like here, you, make yes. Sure not vision there. Right. Okay. I just didn't want to sweep it if there wasn't. Vision and there, and vision listen, there. if you're, but the, the problem, pick. but the problem with that play, this is good that we put you on Nocturne in this game because, like I said, I think you do need a backup pick. The, the thing is, is like, why would you hover in mid there when you have your Instead ult? Of just do this. Right. And ult down. Right, right. 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 Let's go golems down. Okay, go to mid, go to mid, go to mid. Yeah. You'll start at chickens. Zyra is like actually making picks. Varus might be able to find her. Hit the big chicken only. Go to red. Mm -mm 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 -mm. We're done fucking with this. We're never going near this anymore unless we have all, okay? Okay. What about top? She's getting dove. I would peek it. Or I would look at least. Okay. Uh, smite this then. And then we'll go behind the graves. Try to catch him. Try brush. Sure. Assuming. Sure. Either's a gamble. Either's a gamble. He could be on your golems, by the way. Oh. Good find. All right. Take a recall. It's just a guessing game at that point. A lot of this is just trying to get lucky, right? Right. Now, uh, next item. They're very squishy, so I'm just oh. going longsword. I'm going probably going to go dusk blade. Go merc. No, I'm going longsword. I don't care about. I don't care about surviving. I care about picking up a shutdowns. Like, okay. Like when you're in a game like this, you don't give a shit about dying, right? Like you okay. don't give a fuck. You just need to get your gold. Best way to get the gold. Right. So just go dirt, get, build the dust blade, and just start ulting people being cocky. And then you can build beefier later. Okay. Right? If you're ahead, you build beefier behind, you should just build damage on this champ and try to pop yeah. shutdowns. Is this guy what the trying fuck? to troll me here? I don't think he knows how to troll anymore on this new uh <laughs> this new jungle. You might have to smite no. Just keep clearing. Okay. Uh, just keep clearing. You're good. She smited. You're good. Keep clearing. Don't panic. You're fine. You just got lucky. She walked up into it at the last second. All right. So she used both smites. No, no, no. Just keep going. Whatever. Not much you can do about it. I'd look mid for an alt sometimes. But again, it depends on Zoe's sleep. Oh, no. Fuck these guys. Just keep it moving. <laughs> now, everyone's bottom, I go to her wolves. You go to her wolves. We're struggling. It's a kite struggle. We can't go there. Just go wolves and clear. We got to find a good spot. Oh, 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 mid maybe? Nope. Since we got pushed off, let's just recall in the bush. Try to get Dirk. You said Dust Blade here? Yep. I think so. Because, again, they're all squishy. None of them have a stopwatch. Look at these cocky fucks. See what I mean? Right. So you just ult one that gets low and you pick up free gold. Just hover mid. Like, sit at, like, wolves, like, near a bush. Like, sweep, sweep, sweep. Just chill. 
All right, I would go. Oh, wait, she ulted. She ulted. Bottom ulted. Fuck. You got to look at that. You got to be faster on the draw. Hmm. Okay, she's full health, though. I'll just leave. Flash over wall. Yeah, whatever. Go to your chickens. Go up and around your chickens. You keep running towards fights after you leave them. Just keep moving. It's okay. Yeah, just keep moving. Go cue this and keep moving. Careful, you can't go here. She's here. You gotta just sit. Just sit in a bush. Relax. Sit in a bush. Relax. It's okay. Now wait and see if somebody gets poked down or something. Caitlyn's by herself. I, I think I'd take a stab at it. Try it. Fuck it. Try it. Quick. Don't wait. Hear it? It's okay. Next time, fear a little sooner. I don't know. I thought I hit it. That's my bad. It's all good. It's all good. This is an uphill game. Don't worry. We'll just hit the 400 CS sliver and win, right? That's how that works. Uh, yeah, I mean, the idea of going for the Caitlyn is fine. As long as you, as long as you quickly get your fear down. Right. There's a good chance these guys mismanage the mechanics of it. This isn't Korea. They're not always going to E back perfectly, Gale Force perfectly. Like, they're going to fuck up. Right? And she almost did. I mean, you just didn't fear. Right. I would just queue minions and sit back. Hmm. All right. I'm going to, I'm going to shove mid and go to my chickens here and sweep. Oh, okay. You and then try to catch her. I'm gonna chase a little bit. Sweep, sweep. Mm, you gotta be careful. This locks over the wall, though. This could be a tough fight. No, this could be tough to to catch back up, but they still have bounties. They're not really sieging. Hold tab. Check bounties. Still just their bot and right, own. right. I mean, they all have bounties. Uh, I would look to if she, yeah, this should be free. Okay. So your camera work is starting to really struggle now that I have you off this champ or off of Belveth. I would not ult that unless, yeah, unless we know she's by herself. Let's just clear top. Let's go to Golems. Okay, I would ult this Lux probably. She has uh, Cassio there with her. Oh, okay. There was a second person there for a split second. Sweep, sweep. Sit in this bush. They split up, maybe? Man, they just, uh... They're just chilling. Oh my god, here's too late. You keep trying to, but you keep trying to walk through them. You don't have to. You... You like to be way too close as Nocturne. <clears throat> you don't have to do that. Just go up and around. Right? right? That's the whole point is that you my don't have my to go brain, Yeah, my brain was stuck on go to wolves because they should be up. Which was probably still the wrong idea anyways. Yeah, it's, it's not necessary. Oh, there you go. That's a good bubble. This is basically what you're waiting for. Right. So are you looking at... Look at Yavala. Does she ult? Yeah, can... Go, go, go on her. Go on her. She just ulted. Have your ult. She shows. We go. She might clear the wave. All right, go to chickens. Does Cassiope have a bounty or no? No. Okay. Big, big wolf. Or big chicken, I mean. Q, Q and fight. Just fight. Fight, 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 fight. Oh, 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 oh my god. 
<laughs> I, <laughs> just I just fight. didn't think I win it. Well, you do win it. She just salted. <laughs> she just salted. What did I just say? Oh. It's three level. It doesn't matter. <laughs> You keep and like she she can't beat you in a long fight. She has no way to beat you. That's what I'm trying to show you. They're all squishy. <laughs> this is like the slowest moving game ever. Hold tap. You should always be checking who has bounties. Okay. So look at those guys for kills. Okay, he's pretty tanky, so we're going to need somebody to set him up. Hold tap again. Okay, so they might be on Baron. So you're going to inch forward and throw a blue trinket in. Quick. All right. See if we can maybe ult them. Get ready to ult them. Ult, ult, ult. Try it. Oh, you got to be quicker. <laughs> you got to be quicker than this. I, I definitely feel like when it comes to tethering your... Basically, when it comes to tethering your camera to your uh, ult, yes. It's like you're not... It's like... How do I explain this? Do you have you ever laned before? Yeah. You know how like you want to stay just outside of like abilities. Right. I'm not moving my camera out with my ult as I'm. Right. Moving. Right. So, so what's happening? What yeah. Say? So basically, every time that you have a play, oh, yeah, 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 it's Dagger. fine. It's they're fine. Either's fine. This game's probably a wash now, but who knows? We'll see. Maybe they'll be dumb. Oh, that could be f free ish. Wait for your ult. Oh, I don't know if that's going to work versus him. Maybe we go for Lux. Camera on Lux. Back up. Get out of vision. Get out of vision. Get out of vision. And then just alter. Yeah, they're just too fed. <laughs> I'll say right, that. Right. So think of it like this. Your champions ban 22% of the time, right? Right. Now... That means that odds are every day you're gonna have to probably dodge one if you're like doing five. a session, if, right? If I do, if I do five, dodge one and five. Right, I'm gonna do dodge one and five. Oh, you're not gonna dodge again, right. right? So it's very likely that some days are gonna come where Belveth gets banned all day. Right. So that means that now we're playing Nocturne. A couple things started showing up for you, right? Since you're so used to this gap close. Your movement's wonky since you're so right. you you since usually your champion has to go in you're treating nocturne like you have to go like you have to have, be next to have, people have, all the time right so basically the summary of your game is this belveth you spam it you probably get plat probably okay. probably right uh i would have to what i would do is i would play a shit ton of games from now for two weeks and see if that's okay. see if that's holding up right be like, all right, niece, right. I'm, I'm spamming it. Here's where I'm at. But <clears throat> the thing is, outside of Belveth, you're going to be very limited. And if the champion gets taken, you're going to be a liability. And that's fine because that's why we say, you know, you, you want to get your champion mastery down. But right. this is a good opportunity to also see, like, what are your weaknesses. Identity-wise, when you're playing Nocturne there, you pretty much I hit the nail on the head. Too close and right. be out in vision. Instead of playing from fog like you should be. Right. And you keep trying to be close to fights Play and like tell I'm on yourself. Maybe, like I'm playing Belveth. <laughs> right. It's like you're telling on yourself. You're saying, hey, guys, I'm coming. You don't have to do that. 
Um, yeah. But overall, like I said, I, I'm, you know, I put you on the spot there intentionally. Not to, I know you'd played Nocturne before, so I, it wasn't like right. I was trying to make you first time. I just wanted to see where you were at off of this particular champion, like to see how your game looks. And it does look pretty, it looks drastic, right? It looks like on this champion, he could very easily be platinum. On Nocturne, he'd be struggling at gold right now. Right. Right. So that's kind of how you should do it. I mean, I have the same problems. Like right now, if I play Yone, I'd be struggling in fucking, you know, diamond, right? Or fucking right. plat or whatever in Korea, right? right? If I play something like Trindamir, probably going to be a higher tier pick for me. If I play something like Fiora, it's probably going to be a higher tier pick for me. If I play something like Nocturne, it's probably going to be a higher tier pick for me. If I play something like Karma, it's, I'm getting better at it, uh, but it's not as good of a pick as, you see what I mean? I guess instead of playing something like Nocturne, another champion that I've had success with the last couple of days would be Sejuani, which would basically be me wanting to be frontlining anyways, and then I wouldn't be... I yeah, I mean, that's one way to look at it. Another way to look at it is, though, that, like, I I feel like Sejuani is not going to carry as hard as a Nocturne would, though, because these players right. that you're playing against, they have no minimap, dude. They have no object permanence, which means they don't know right. that Nocturne exists. That's why I kept trying to get you off the screen. Where I play, if I run around with Nocturne, people run away like they know I'm there, dude. Right. Where you play, I say, walk off the screen, their heads explode. Do you understand? And, and that, that may, no, that makes perfect sense because I've had it playing even Belveth where I just jump in a lane bush after ganking a lane and then they walk up two seconds later. Right. It's just, it is what it is. They just don't give you credit for, for anything. Or it's not that they don't give you credit. They just, they just don't know, man. It's a thinking game and they're not thinking. They're not respecting it. Right. They're just like, if I, if, if I play a career right now and I shove mid and I walk off the screen, right? If I play Nocturne and I walk right. off the screen, you can literally see everybody just back up, right? But I know play from NA, like if I do the same exact thing, I shove mid and I walk off the screen. Everybody just stands where they are. Like, I didn't just do that. Right? So that's what you need to start incorporating. Overall, though, I didn't hate the gameplay, dude. I think that, you know, it, it would be discouraging after that game. But, like, I, I gave you, I gave you the, the, the strat. And, yeah, you missed some combos. That happens. But you also need to see, like, any time that you've got a big squishy comp like that, just in your behind... Don't think like, oh, I've got to build defense. Like, fuck that. Just try to get shutdowns okay. and slowly slide your way back in. And the other thing is, any squishy champion, like like Evelyn, there's an exploit case. If she ults, because like every time someone was fighting next to you, you weren't looking at it. But she ults, you could see that on minimap, even. Right. So if you see her go in on somebody and then she warps backwards... That's always an ult. Yeah, that's always an ult. So then you go, anytime I see her in the next 30 seconds or so, I'm just going to ult her. 